now that we're already feeling it. A lot of you may be thinking about maybe a summer haircut. I know these guys are. In fact, they're thinking about it, and they're thinking about doing a great cause, too. St. Baldrick's uses clippers to conquer kids with cancer. Check this out. my head for six years to conquer kids' cancer. I'm shaving my head for Kaylee. For Jalen and Brianna. For fighting cancer. For fight kids' cancer. So great and so emotional too. We've got the event organizer here, Sam Kakoulis, along with again our two brave souls. We've got Joe and Tyler, and also Lauren, who is their stylist with the Clippers. And so before um, I get to these guys, I want to talk to you, Sam. I was reading there was a frightening statistic on the St. Baldrick's website that reads in part this: Worldwide, the number of children who will die from childhood cancer this year would nearly fill the stadium seats at Fenway Park. Five times that many will be diagnosed. Sam, obviously those are scary numbers. So how does St. Baldrick's help to fight childhood cancer? All right. Well, this is a really pressing issue. So if you want to get involved, what people do is they make a profile on the St. Baldrick's website. They, in an act of solidarity, shave their heads like these guys are doing today for us. And they raise money for that. All the money and the proceeds go straight to finding a, you know, a cure and finding, you know, the research to do that. And you have a great event happening this weekend. Yeah, we're really excited about it. Down in Tempe, the Thirsty Lion. We're going to put it on. We're going to have people shave their heads, raise some money, do a little fundraising. It's going to be a really great time. And But what if people can't make it this weekend? If people can't make it, they can actually go on to the St. Baldrick's website, search Thirsty Lion Tempe. They'll find the profiles of Joe, Tyler, Courtney. We're raising some money, donating their names, and, you know, help support us a little bit. Okay, and speaking of Courtney, look at this gorgeous gal over here with her beautiful beautiful, lovely locks. Can you believe she will be there on Saturday to shave off all your locks? Are you, are you having second thoughts about doing this at all? Not second thoughts, but I'm definitely nervous. Oh my God. I think I'm more excited than nervous, though. I am so excited for you. That is huge. Okay, but the guys, though, again, you are going to do this now because we're going to do a little preview. How are you feeling? A little nervous. Have you ever been bald? I have. Oh, you have? Yeah. So, oh, Oh, it's not that big of a <laughs> deal then. Not biggie, yeah. Okay, but Tyler, what about you? It's just hair. <laughs> oh, I like that attitude. Have you ever been bald? Um, not since like third grade. <laughs> <laughs> and why was it so important for you to do this? Um, I, it's just a good cause. I'm an elementary teacher. Like I'm student teaching right now, and so I, it's okay. a good cause. Yeah, I help kids any way I can. And a great message to your kids too, who you're teaching too. And why do you want to do this? I just did it for a good cause. Uh, Seen a people doing it back in Portland and figured why not. So good for you guys. Okay, Lauren, are you ready? We want to help everybody and we want to be a part of events that help children and any way that I can help and donate my time, I'm happy to do it. Well go for it, honey. Do it. Okay. You're yeah. going ball. Again. Again. Yeah. How's it feel? No, Ooh. not too bad. The opposite of a mohawk, as we are seeing now. <laughs> it's a good look for you. Well, thanks. Maybe we should stop it right here. What do you think, Lauren? Let's, let's leave them like this. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, Lauren's going to keep on shaving away here. Oh, boy, those lovely locks. And so right now, though, we want to go out to the plaza where they are going green with Haley Francis. Hi, hey, Haley. Hi, Trim. Tell them to just keep that patch right there in the I front. Know, I like That's that. a good look.